The picture is almost 30 years old now, a young Giants fan in the fall of 92 at what many thought was the team's final game in San Francisco. You know, you can see the emotion um, in my face. Like, I, I truly thought that that could be my last um, Giants game because I thought they were moving to, to Florida. That broken-hearted kindergartner is Brandon Crawford. As you know, the move to Florida never happened. And since then, Crawford's seen thousands more San Francisco Giants games. Uh, I don't know exactly how many games I went to. I know I went to a, a pretty good amount, though. I, was, I mean, I was a huge fan. Crawford grew up just across San Francisco Bay and spent a lot of his childhood dressed in orange and black at Candlestick Park. In 2000, when the Giants moved to what's now Oracle Park, Crawford's dad bought season tickets. My dad actually still has those same tickets. They're, they're ironically like right in line with shortstop. The Giants are Crawford's team. San Francisco, Crawford's city. And that's why he works so hard to give back, teaching the game, and renovating rundown fields in the very neighborhoods he used to run around in. It was kind of like right at, right in the shadow of, of where Candlestick used to be and, you know, where I grew up watching games and was um, really special to be a part of. Three decades later, the kid who thought he'd seen his last Giants game has now played more games at shortstop than anyone in the history of the franchise. No life is perfect, but Brandon Crawford's feels pretty close. You know, 10 years later, still being here with a couple World Series, hopefully another one coming soon. I mean, it's about as perfect as, as I could have ever imagined, for sure.